Hello, today I will be doing a review on the V ready to use wax strips. You know, I really wasn't enjoying the results of shaving because I don't like the stubbly feel of your legs when the hair starts growing back. So I got this. And this I got at Walmart for around $7 more or less. It was really inexpensive for wax and basically what you're getting. It comes with 40 full-size wax strips and 6 wipes. I'm a total noob at waxing. I don't know if you can really count my word for it. I've never gone to a salon to get my legs professionally waxed. So I wanted to try waxing. But I didn't want to go to the salon to pay $35 or more to get my legs waxed. I just thought, why not do it at home? This actually really works. I have to say, I'm very impressed. And I really thought it wasn't going to work. I read some reviews online and it was kind of so-so. Like some people liked it and some people didn't. And I'm one of those people who actually liked it. How you use it. There's an instruction sheet inside. It comes in one sheet. And I basically just followed what is on the sheet. You can reuse the strip for a different spot. Like... You have to do it right away though. You'll see in the demo. I like that because then you don't really have to waste so many strips. Um, cutting it makes it easier and I feel like you get more use out of the wax when you cut it up. However, the first time I used it, I didn't cut it up. I feel like it lasted longer. I don't know if it's just me. It just lasted longer the first time around and the second time it didn't. But I still really like it. I also like this method because it's not messy. You don't need to heat up wax. You don't need a popsicle stick to scoop wax. It's ready to use and that's what I really love about it. So the first thing I do is wet a towel. I just need a wet towel to kind of wipe it over my legs so all of my hair goes in one direction. <laughs> one direction. That's funny. Okay, so here's kind of like a before shot of my legs. As you can see, my hair. Now I'm getting the wax out of the box, of course, because you need that. <laughs> and in on the strips, there are little picture instructions. And now I'm just rubbing the strip in between my hands to warm it up because you need it to be warm. And you'll know when it's warm because your hands will get warm too. And I'm going to cut the strips in half. So I can get more use out of the strip. So now that I've cut the strip in half, I'm just going to rub it in between my hands again to get it very, very ready for when I start waxing and when I take them apart. So now that's how it would look when it's apart and I would just place it on the hair that easily. And I kind of press on the strip just because, I don't know. And you want to pull back. You don't want to pull upwards. You want to pull backwards if that makes sense. I hope it does. See, you ha you want to pull it back in that motion. And BAM! I hope you can see that there is no more hair. I don't think it's doing any justice. But I'm reusing the same strip on the bottom part because I can and you can too. And it'll save you strips and it'll save you money too, I guess. And it still works. See, there's the yucky hair. I like to look at the hair um, once I get it out it, and see the difference between the fresh one and the non-fresh one. So here I am doing it again for you guys. Make sure to pull it back like that and don't pull it up. Pull it back. So BAM! I think this time you can see the difference of like the hair. Now I'm just doing it again. I don't know if it's still the same side. There you go. See? Uh, yeah, you can see the difference. So that's the hair. I know, very gross, but I think it looks kind of cool. And I like to put the strips back together after I use it because... I don't know! It looks cool when they're together. Um, yeah. So yeah, I struggle doing that. And here is a clip of me showing you that the right leg is now hairless and the left leg still has a bunch of hair. I hope you can tell the difference. I can. So, <laughs> And now I'm taking these perfect finish wipes 
that come with the kit and you you're gonna wipe this all over where you waxed and it's gonna take off all the excess wax that was left over because there will be some and if you so happen to get some wax on your hands it will take that off too because I think this is some kind of oil based product that will take off wax and yes yeah, so it took off all the wax you just need to wipe it everywhere um, one wipe will suffice you don't need another wipe one wipe will do the job that's probably why the kit only comes with six wipes. I don't know if anyone's curious, but I did try using this on my bikini line. I tried to give myself a bikini wax, but I don't recommend doing that. I can talk about this, right, on YouTube. Anyway, first time I did it, I cut it in half, and I didn't know that you can cut it into tinier proportions, which is stupid of me, I know. I only cut it in half, and then I tried to wax my hair down there. It didn't really work out as planned. It really didn't come across my mind that the tinier the portion, the better it is. I pulled it and it was just gross. Like, there was just wax. I didn't even pull out a single hair. What I do suggest, if you do want to try it out for the bikini area, is cut it up in smaller portions, maybe in fours or fives and use it one by one and that's like 10 strips right there and it does say exfoliate 24 hours before waxing on the instructions i sh i didn't listen to it i read it i'm like oh okay whatever but i i really do suggest doing that for better results it will leave your legs with little bumps the first few hours or even the first day but the second day it'll be gone from my experience it didn't really get the bumps that you usually get, you know, like when you get your eyebrows threaded or so. Um, my legs didn't really react to it as my face would. I didn't really bother trying to wax the back of my legs. If anything, I just shaved the parts because I couldn't really reach the back of my legs. What surprised me also is it picked up little tiny hairs. I didn't really have high expectations for this product. and. It impressed me and it's it's really good you guys I highly recommend reading the instructions it really does help you it helped me a lot so yeah I hope you guys give this a try I hope you found this review helpful thank you so much for watching until next time bye